Hello my good people, welcome to the channel. This is Wadeki Auto Trading as usual. So today I wanted to show you these heavy duty cars here. Of course these are Hilux Revo, 2.5 liter. Uh, it's an awesome car if you have a construction company or you have a delivery company, maybe when you talk Peleka Maji, Kampunia Soda and all that. This is a car that is, uh, it's a heavy duty car that can do uh, all those tricks for you. Sawa. So let me show you guys what this car can do. It's one of the best actually, Toyota Hilux Revo. It has a 2.4 liter engine, it's a diesel, and of course it's a manual. Onyesha manual hapa wasifikire na yendesha gari automatic bro. This is a manual transmission car here. It's one of the most powerful vehicles that you can get anywhere. Apart from the Hilux 2.8 liter double cab. So this is one of the most brilliant cars here. Acha ni zime kidogo so that I take you around and see what kind of car we are dealing with here. Now guys, what do you think about this particular vehicle here? So this one is a two-wheel drive and uh, the price of this particular unit starts at uh, 3.2, sorry, 3.3 million shillings. Of course, you can always negotiate. It will come down to around 3.1. That is the last price. If you want the four-wheel drive, four-wheel drive Kidogo Beyake Ime, it's an upscale uh, for that. But this one also is a very nice car, actually. Let me show you from the front. You have this, what is it called? It's a fitting. I don't know what's the purpose, but in a funny gari na kofiti. Omisema used forever. So, usikuwe gari ukeenda kwa kwa nisani yako uko. It's only forever. It has, it has cool headlights, but of course it's still the halogen headlight. This is not a luxury car. Ni gari ya kufanya heavy duty. Heavy duty stuff is not part of luxury. Iko na fog lights hapa. It has a very nice looking grill over here. It looks massive. It has the Toyota emblem. And... Uh, to top on that, it has very good ground clearance and uh, what gives us all that ground clearance is that we have very nice suspensions and you have these off-roading tires, sour. Uh, come on, talk for heavy duty, there are two types of tires you need to use. You need to use the old terrain tires or you go for the mud terrain tires. That's if kama uko uko bara, kama uko petu, nandi county mali kuna nyesha, you need to go on a tire, kuna threads mzuri, na joku grip mzuri. But all terrain tires in a kupeleka mali kupote sand, kwa snow na nini they are the best one is kuna threads fit so these ones are mud terrain tires ikona steel wheels hapo of course this is not a luxury car so mambo ya alloys nini that's on you steel wheels with wheel caps fit to fit ikona side steps because of course getting into this car inaitaji uh, mali pa kujishikulia kidogo ndio wengine ndani so unakanyaga hapa then you get into your hilux sawa but before you go into the inside let me show you the back side uh, I love the fact that this car has these skins in his Meko Hapa. You see the Revo skins in Meko Hapa. There are so many, they are different. When I'm in a black, I'll show you over there. You have your Revo uh, badging Hapa, of course, for the fuel cup. And then we have diesel so that we secure a unit of petrol station squeezy. The ladies in the car are going to go to the car. We are going to go to the car. We are going to go to the car. Sawa. So this one is purely diesel. It has this flat bed that is, uh, it has a lot of volume. Eh? I love the volume here, when the Jew is infinity. You want to funga it in the Jew. But uh, I think the maximum is three meters and you're allowed to funga something like that. But I don't know how to funga easy view to the Jew. You have a lot of space. You can use it as a swimming pool. Um, uh, <laughs> you want to have a seal up or a maji, especially in climates like this, you can put, you can hold water there. Then, uh, of course, you see this, you have this part here. You open this one, you stretch them all the way in Pokamahali, then you tie those uh, notifications. Are they notifications? I'm a warning sign, so yes, it's a notification, it's not a phone. Sawa, so on a hacker. It's a very heavy door. Heavy duty that is, Kitosafi, on a hapa, come on back, and done well and good. You have your exhausts. Iko hapa kitu safi, and then um, you have this large suspension at least in a kupatia angle of departure. Eh? Oh. Yeah, mtu wangu, kuna spare tire hapa, and then uh, kuna what's axles pale. Mm? Yeah, ikona to leave suspension spear. So this one is a TRD Sportiro. TRD na matenga nini? Toyota Racing Development. Sportiro, it's an amazing, amazing unit. So wacha tuangalia hapa ndani. On the driver's side, you have this door here. 
that is very basic it is not a luxury car naona hapo omeka ile texture ya leather but it's not leather it's a plastic storage compartment kuna speaker hapa controls for the windows naona tu the only how many buttons two kuna manambo mengi ignition key ignition iko hapa in the other cars kuna push to start hapa automatic headlights iko pale na fungo ya bonnet ya fuel cap over there kuna AC vents of course Steering wheel yako kazuri with no controls these are very basic units Mhm kwani yako to know that uh, the car is okay then you have these seats here these are leather seats very comfortable i don't know if they are heated and cooled but kuna perforations uh, maybe mwenye alikuwa anatumia tu ameamua kujikea vitu zake it is manual adjustable kuna lever hapa and then kuna e part so you can push it front and back if you need to manual handbrake of course it's a manual car so these are some of the things that come with manual car your gear lever kako hapa kazuri sana ac controls iko hapa natumia zile knobs za manual kawaida okay so you are talking about the manual adjustable seat ushamaliza manual handbrake yako iko hapa your gear lever controls for the ac of course the bado natumia zile what, what do you call this the manual buttons ah huh? because uh, inaweza kuwa you are somewhere umevaa gloves zako you are handling some heavy duty stuff so ukikuja hapa with your gloves you can still hold this properly imagine ingekuwa touch screen unataka kuweka ac uko kwa winter of course na hizo gloves ungezishika hiyo infotainment system another thing kwa infotainment system nyingine hapa very very basic but it has everything that you, do, you want in a in an infotainment system ni kitu safi sana angalia iko na fm mm, acha tu tune tukaleka wapi uh, 88.7 Eh, copyright ita tushika bro acha nipunguze sauti so, so that's it ukiwa na hapa kuna auxiliary output kuna usb slots to charge your phone sawa so, infotainment yako iko sawa hapa tu utasikia tu radio bro hakuna kitu kingine kuangalia hapa your hazard button kako hapa your clock so that ukifanya kazi unajua kama imefika time ya kwenda lunch ama time ya kushuka break usije uka overwork then here kuna clusters zako Uh, you can show them the clusters hapa angalia mileage mileage is 50k so mtu asikuja akasema oh mileage imeenda mileage haijaenda bro this is awesome mileage iko to 50000 you get your notifications hapa juu ya headlights uh, electronic parking ah, sorry parking brake kwa hapa nini everything goes here alafu kuna speedometer yako it goes all the way to 200 km per hour of which uh, it's virtually impossible uh, unless if you're driving like a maniac sawa so, well and good ama you are in emergency. The dashboard is basic aina features mingi ni kiari tu ya kawaida. Then hapa on the top your visor. Eh eh juu kuna interior lighting. Ah I love the color. Aha, ah. uh -huh. wewe kama ni mtu wa macho ine, unarusha glass zako hapa, unazifunga then you focus on driving. Kama uwezi ona mbali usiendeshe gari. Sawa? Uh, uh, and then also in this car is my friend here anaitwa Dave. Yeah, probably atafungua channel yake very soon. Mm, anaitwa Dave. Yeah, huko juu kuna oh yeah. So uh, guys, what do you think about these particular units? Unaweza kuambia whether there kuna two glove compartment hapa. Yes, uh, there are two actually. Kuna hii ya chini and then there is another one here. Yes, so there are two storage compartments over there. Alafu kuna hii part yenye inakuonyesha the airbag iko on. Hapo ukicheza vizuri utapigwa ngumu nyingine kwa na hiyo airbag hapo. Then here You have these two seats in any camera so you are they were playing around with the design of what kwa sababu kuna full seat hapa na hapo kwa katikati wameka kati pengine kana inaweza kuwa unaweza pair ni seats okay it's they are jointed together sawa it's quite nice so acha tuwafungulie bonnet tuangalie si ndio yeah yeah Mm-hmm. So uh if you're wondering what kind of engine sits here, we have a 2GD FTV engine that sits inside here. This is a four cylinder 2.4 liter diesel engine on this particular unit. This gives you a lot of torque uh, because this car is uh, torque oriented. It needs that pulling power and the diesel engine gives you that power. So it can haul heavy stuff for a, a very long time and over long distances without getting that exhaustion sawa the engine is quite powerful ecofit sana i love it uh, if you want a more powerful engine then you could go for the 
the double cab Hilux which has a 2.8 liter either petrol or diesel. So it's a nice unit, I love it but personally, uh, but I don't like the single cab, I love double cab. Uh, if you're going for the double cab, you're sacrificing on the space at the back there. But uh, if you want this single cab, you know probably what you are, you are doing. So the price for this one, uh, I'll say it again, it's uh, 3.3 million shillings. If you negotiate properly, it will come down to 3.1, which is the last price. Ukisema nokpatia 3,900, ah, 3 million. Let me show you other cars in Yeziko. We have a number of options <laughs> for you. I wanted to break down something for you, like in Yesa, we I guess I'm hungry. We have one here, we have another one there. All these are two wheel drives. There is one here gray, also it's a two wheel drive. And then on top of all that, we have a 9L, Toyota Hires 9L. If you, you're doing long distance traveling, I'm going to talk company. I'm already you have a company and we're looking to add more. We have 9L here. These two are diesel, manual, but then we have one diesel automatic. Pale Musho. That one is a little bit cheap, 5 million. Yeah, but these two here, these ones are 5.5 million. They come with seats on the inside. Very nice looking, powerful engine, 3 liter diesel, and then it is manual. Sour. So that is a heavy, heavy beauty car right here. So is Gary Nyemini Mwanyesha Leo, they are only meant for heavy duty. Sour. So if you love the content, guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel, Wadeki Auto Trading. Uh, every day we are looking to improve the channel so that you'll be seeing beautiful things kindly subscribe. See you in the next one. Uh, I'm uh, with somebody here. Uh, here the, I'm a part of contract here, cameraman. Dave, ah, I was. see you guys in the next video. So we'll reverse this one to its place.